three minutes to better gear, more like 15, 15 minutes to better gear. It's gonna take a little while today. What's up guys, Dan here, Cold Cracker Bushcraft. That's right, I'm not in the woods. I'm here at the shop. Everybody's getting after it on Black Friday here. But I wanted to show you some of our new products that I'm super excited about. And it gets to share with everybody out there all the cool stuff that we're getting to do here. Plus everybody loves gear. Who doesn't love gear and it's a Christmas season? You can get all your significant others to buy gear for you or you buy it for them even if they don't like the outdoors and when they don't use it, it's then yours. So let's just dig right into it. So since I've been a little kid, like real little, I have been carrying backpacks, like real, real little. <laughs> like even littler than this guy. And do you love, how much do you love a backpack? Uh, scale one to 10, 11. I mean, who doesn't love a backpack? And from the very beginning of Cold Cracker, one thing that I've always wanted to do was backpacks. And I just never got around to it. It was tough just designing them, figuring out the components. But guess what? Guess what? We came out with two. This one and this one. Uh, I'm gonna show you them today, all the little details, how nice they are, how great they are, and how much you're gonna love them in the woods. But before we get to that, we also released these flannels, which are super nice, super, super nice. Very nice fitted nice looking this is the black and gray one we also have this green and black one they're both available right now on the website so super nice you can look stylish when you're in the woods because we know that's so important and we also came out with a bunch of new hoodies so check all that stuff out and a new knife called a Skinner that looks just like that so this thing was originally designed for a friend of mine who goes on hunting trips all over the world and he wanted um, a skin knife for himself and his hunting partners and then also the guides that he goes with so we made a whole bunch of these and if you were a blade show a few years ago you might have got your hands on one of these and then we just never got back around to them but they are back so skinners we have these bad boys right now nice little knives to carry around but let's get to the backpacks because that's the good stuff okay so these are the two backpacks we'll go over them individually this is our cabin pack and this one here is our ccb you pack. So the cabin pack is made of oil cloth canvas. It does have some spots that has heavier 18 ounce wax canvas on it. Also wax canvas on the bottom of it right down here just for durability sake. Um, this is a 20 liter pack bucket style with a tie lid. So you can see right here you just untie it this way. It opens up into a big pocket style pack and then oh what do we have? Another new hoodie. Check this out for all your beer drinkers. So we got that that thing happening here, but big bu bucket style pack. And then on the front, we have a nice big pocket for all your essentials that you gotta get too quick with our snaps on. So you can throw your stuff in there and you'll be good to go. Now, a cool feature with this also, other than the bag itself, is that the lid, okay, if you notice, we don't have any zippers or anything here, but what we do have is this loop right here. So say you're out all night and your gum blanket is soaking wet in the morning or your tarp or your rain jacket, instead of sticking it back in your backpack, you can use this external loop on the pocket to slide that wet equipment through and that way when you're on your way home it just stays here it's not getting everything inside wet um, so I really like that feature itself that we built into it and then we have fully adjustable straps here with nice heavy-duty cotton webbing foam pads so they're comfortable and they ride really nice on your back um, and that is our cabin pack now the second pack that I'm going to talk about is our yucca pack which you might be thinking I heard that before and literally this is where we got the idea from. This is an actual Boy Scout, Boy Scouts of America Yucca backpack that I took apart to get close to copying. We didn't copy it exactly because there were some downfalls, but this backpack has always been like the staple of outdoor goers forever. And uh, one of the biggest downfalls with it though, if I can find here, is just the strapping in the back made for, of course, little Boy Scouts. So if you're a normal size human being, 
or a big human being like myself, you will never fit in these straps. They have always been a nightmare. And um, these packs are getting old now. They're from the 60s and 70s. So when you do find them, they're pretty beat up. So what we did was we revamped that whole thing. So same style, same concept, just in the cold cracker fashion. So what we did here is we went with a um, water resistant um, number eight duck canvas, okay? We have the leather hardware and buckles on the front so you can open this up not as awkward as I'm opening it up right now because I'm on camera and I'm, you know, what I mean. But we have this nice pocket in the front here again for those things you got to get to quickly. And then tie out just like the original pack had, flips open. And then your two top flaps to close it in a little bit. Cinch points down each side. So when you load this thing out, you can then pull that tight or if you want to store equipment in there, ton of different options there. This pack also has your adjustable shoulder straps that are padded. Okay, really, really nice. And you can see they're nice and big and wide for normal size human beings. And then your carry handle and some leather accents. So overall, a great throwback pack that we are super excited to come out with. So let me put these things on and show you how nice they ride. All right, so up first, Yucca Pack, and it, it complements my flannel so well, but here. So rides really nice, great day pack. You can also strap stuff to the bottom if you would want to, um, if you have larger blankets or anything for these colder winter months. But um, it rides really nice, like I said, comfortable. The straps, they only get better with age. I've been using this one for a while now, so uh, it's coming along really well. And in our cabin pack, a little bit lighter of a backpack because it's made with lighter weight material, but still is durable and trusty as the Yucca pack that we are using. So you can see this thing comes out great, fits well, very comfortable. Um, again, straps made for normal human beings, not super small. Um, you're gonna be happy with it. All right, so that's today's better gear. Because I can't say three minutes because this was definitely over three minutes, but I know you all loved it and you love bags and packs. And if you get two, you can carry them like this and uh, it'll make everybody happy. So um, definitely check them out. Links are in the description below. If you're watching this today on Black Friday, um, I also have a discount code. You gotta go over to our Instagram or Facebook page to get that. So uh, go check that out right now and uh, you'll be good to go. So, hope you enjoyed this video. As always, check us out at coldcrackerbushcraft.com. Remember, discount code's over on Facebook and Instagram. Until the next video, stay in the woods, or stay in the woods with our gear. I'm in the woods as soon as we're done working here. See everybody else working, and I'm messing around on the video.